and welcome back to Press X for Chromosomes, Fire Emblem Radiant Dawn. Blast! Being ambushed. Ugh. Turn back. Brothers, turn back. Never! <laughs> what did you just say? We're the beast tribe. I'd rather die than be a coward. Oh, you get eyes? That's a first dude. Like, oh, yeah, no. They actually have a little... They actually put effort into the, like, expendable portraits. <laughs> Fine. No pulling back. We stay here and fight to the last. All forces attack. Well, that's your big dumb. Yep. Oh, She's they all, like, there. growled. <laughs> oh, Aaron. Leth, are you out here? Where are you? Liar, what are you doing here? Lev, oh, Lev, you're safe. I'm so glad you're all right. Why are you sneaking around? Get back into position. What? Oh, how dare you? I was just... Ugh, forget it. I don't care what happens to you anyways. I'm sorry, liar. It's much too dangerous here. Get back in position. Now. Good Every old sisters. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that shit I'm familiar with. Yeah, I'm like, yeah, no one cares in my family. Fuck, you want to be out here? Awesome! Yes, yeah. <laughs> have it. We'll, we'll die together. Yeah, pretty much. Whoa! Oh, God fucking, come on. <laughs> he is going to be wading through water. <laughs> yeah, he was not going to be able to get anywhere fast. No. If Vol I had a problem crossing the river, he's going to have a fucking problem oh. crossing the river. I might have him just fucking move over to the fucking right side, because at least there's <laughs> enough land. He can, like, double <laughs> hit. <laughs> All right. <sighs> <laughs> Sir Knight, you're safe. But where have you been? Fucking, ugh. <laughs> I'm not waiting around in water. <laughs> My maiden, I shall not ask you why. You chose. You chose to engage in this battle. I, my brain is like, what words? <laughs> How sentence form is what? <laughs> For that, you have my thanks. I am here to protect you. They're needed, or they need be no other reason. Do not leave my side. I understand. Then I shall not ask you why you have been absent. Sweet. I want you to know, I'm happy to see you again. I'm very glad you're safe. Yeah. <laughs> Go fucking help Nolan. We're holding down the fort over here. <laughs> kind of. This is pointless. The Galleon soldiers just keep coming, no matter how many we take down. If we keep this up, both sides will take horrible casualties. Ugh, can't find an opening. If only I could find one weak point, we could break through. These guys are really clever. They must have a veteran commander to use a strategy like this. To fucking hang out at a river? Yeah. He's like, whoa. <laughs> like, man, galleons are really low on their fucking strategy. <laughs> Ran off, but what about General Skirmir? Isn't he supposed to be at the back of the army? You know how he is. I've got six strong men trying to keep Skirmir from coming out here. All right, then. We'll show these Bjork a real fight. We should regroup and... Wait. Look. Over there. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> my Sorry, Rano. Ike, look! <laughs> Up there! <laughs> Wait, look. Over there. <laughs> Robot. <laughs> All troops, lower your weapons. I'm going to propose a ceasefire to the Lagu's alliance. Are you? Are you really? I've seen that black army before. You're with the Dan army. Why is Dan attacking us? Good question. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, what the fuck? We just want to leave. Are you the general of this army? I am Akai, a general of the Dan Royal Army. Wait, you're the one in command? My king, Peleus, has decided to answer Banyan's request for help in the Fighting Lagos Alliance. You have no chance for victory. Further bloodshed is meaningless. Please surrender while you can. Do not insult us, tiny Bjork. We'd rather die than surrender. Behind you lies the Banyan Army. In front of you li is the Dan Army. You've nowhere to run. Well, I guess we can't, or I guess we'll have to just chase you down like cattle and press on. Sound good to you, Skirmir? All right. <laughs> what in the goddess's name was that? Get back, Micaiah. That roar. That must be a lion. I know my animal <laughs> sounds. The cow goes moo. <laughs> <laughs> lion like goose are stronger than the cat or tiger like goose we've been fighting. Hey, is that you, Soth? <laughs> you look much older now. Beer grow up so fast. Wow, your midriff. What is up with the shirt? <laughs> Just like Ike. Remember him, Soth? What? 
So Commander Ike really is fighting with you. Micaiah, see you later. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but, well, and fucking smart on fucking Randall for bringing that up. Because oh. he's like, yeah, because now Soth is like, I really don't want to fight yeah. anymore. <laughs> yeah. Let's just say you shouldn't assume that you can see all of our troops. Soth, if you care for this girl at all, get her and her men out of here. That's my only warning to you. Wait. Stop, Micaiah. If we chase them, they'll kill us for sure. Also, let's defect. <laughs> Yeah, also, fuck, <laughs> fuck King Pelias. He's creepy. Pushover. Oh, hey. General Tornillo, what brings you out here? Has something happened to the king? No, I am here to deliver supplies and to see how the battle fares. You've made, you made up a clever excuse and convinced the king to let you come here. I'm impressed. Thanks for coming, General Torino. Don't worry about it. I trust that the fight is going well against the Lagoos Alliance. Yes, but the enemy seems to have additional forces deployed in the area. I expect another battle to begin very soon, and I doubt it'll be easy as the last. So, we still remain on the brink of battle, I see. With the Black Knight won't be hard at all. Yeah, fucking Black Knight wiping out everybody. <laughs> yeah. I shall do my best to defeat the Lagoos Alliance quickly. When this battle is over, please persuade the king to negotiate a peace treaty as soon as possible. Would you do this for me? Would you please talk to the king and help to stop this pointless war? I shall try. You just have to put the bug in his ear, and he'll be like, "Yo, yeah, okay." I love him, Makai. Yeah, <laughs> it's you're, my, you're my best. You're my best friend. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, you're making me, me live feel. now, honey. <laughs> yeah. Okay, that took a little bit longer than I thought it would. Yeah, that was a kind of a tough fight. Yeah. At least I only died once. The day an army takes to the field and deals a heavy blow to the army of the Lagoos Alliance. This sudden aggression shocks the Alliance like a lightning bolt on a clear day. With their only avenue of retreat blocked, the forces of the Lagoos Alliance begin to despair. As the last shred of hope is fading, Skrimir appears before his troops and rallies them on, bolstering their failing strength. Galleon morale is further improved by the appearance of Tabarn at Ike's forces. <gasps> we ran here! <laughs> yeah. Tabarn's like, I don't know why I ran, but I did. <laughs> My legs don't work very well. I just that, fly all the time. That's why he's exhausted, because he physically <sighs> ran. Ike's like, I'm impressed. Yeah. <laughs> you need more cardio workout. Fuck that, I have wings. <laughs> Soren clips them. <laughs> <laughs> like, Soren, you dick. What? It doesn't hurt you physically. <laughs> yeah. Man, we're just going back and forth. <laughs> the Dayan army is working with Benya? That's unexpected to say at the least. Uh, Sorry, I got like a head rush really quick. <laughs> and I was like, oh, Tib aren't speaking. God damn it. <laughs> Why would Dayan join the war? I thought all the resources would be tied up in reconstruction. Yeah, that bothers me too. There's something weird about all of this. Didn't Dayan resent Benyon's occupation? Why would they be so quick to help out their former enemy? Thank you! <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, they fucking bring up a lot of shit. <laughs> Why does not matter? We're running out of time. We must deal with this quickly for her to get home. General Skirmir, have you recovered from your wounds already? Fucking Lagoos! <laughs> yes, do not underestimate the healing power of the Beach Tribe. The Hawk Tribe, on the other <laughs> hand, like looks at Tivarn. Everyone's dead. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> All right, everyone's here. Let's begin the uh, let's begin the meeting. Let's uh, beginning the begin meeting. Beginning, beginning <laughs> the beginning. -ing. The immediate threat is the Dayan army. They're dug in around the area that we'll have to use to cross the river. On maybe we can find another spot to cross. No, we can't afford it. If we waste any more time, the Central Army will catch up to us. If that happens, we're dead. Randolph, tell me your impression of the Dayan army. You know anything special? Well, there weren't many, or very many of them, but their morale was really up there. Their commander seemed very clever as well. It must be the Man of Dawn. <laughs> Who? Fucking, you should know I keep tabs on everybody, fucker. Yeah. She was the hero of the recent day in Uprising. Micaiah is her name, if I recall correctly. Supposedly, she has information, or she has... <laughs> I fucking wow, she has information. Yeah, <laughs> suppose she has performed miracles and turned many losing battles into victories. An interesting figure. Miracles? I'm finding that a bit hard to swallow. Are you sure about that? Yeah, she has silver hair, which is oddly, you know, really fucking weird. Uncommon. Apparently, yeah. Who knows? Personally, I doubt it. All I know 
is that Dan, the Dane army believes in her miracles, which makes her dangerous. Let's kill her. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, like there's so in the background. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that kid's <laughs> around too, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. This made this main of Donna is supposed to be the savior of Dan, whose miraculous powers freed their people from tyranny. In other words, her followers are fanatics who see her as a goddess. She will make a formidable enemy. Enemy. He just like rubs his hand together. I'm gonna mm. murder her. Excellent. <laughs> <laughs> if we attack them head on, the fighting won't stop until one side is decimated. There's gotta be a way to avoid that, right? What about a decoy force, like we've used in the past? The decoy... Ugh. <laughs> the deco only worked because the enemy didn't expect it. I would count I wouldn't count on the same strategy working twice. Not necessarily. The Empire assumes superiority all over all other countries. Benya is only using the Dayan army as a pawn to stop us, and likely won't care if it's destroyed in the process. As such, the Dayan army is most likely uninformed about our past tactics. You might have a point there. I went scouting after the fog cleared. And their forces looked really unprepared to fight us. Yeah, they have two people that just hung out in the back corner of the last battle. You know, <laughs> yeah, I was like, useless. I was like, not fucking using those two. They're yeah. weak as shit. And one of them dies really super fucking easy. So yeah, um, and one know. one was pretty much a guaranteed death too. But you know, it was better than nothing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they had no ballast, and they hadn't fielded any fire mages. It felt so, it felt like they didn't know a thing about fighting like ooze. Then we should definitely have a decoy force and hit them head on, while the bulk of the army crosses the river in the meantime. I'll head up the decoy force. The decor, de de decoy force, then. <laughs> the armies of Galia and Phoenix can cross the river while we fight. It's not like the Phoenix was a hard time crossing the goddamn river. Yeah. <laughs> Kaka, motherfuckers. Ka uh, I'm tired. Just walk. <laughs> <laughs> I'll go, we'll ride the Lagoos. Yeah. <laughs> we'll ride the Galleons. <laughs> They're just preening their feathers on the back of the line. They're like, the, could you not? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'll go with you, Ike. Dane would get suspicious if they didn't see any lagoos in the enemy force. Sounds like a plan to me. Take some of my men as well if you want. I don't want their talons getting dull. Tibarn, you have more pressing matters back at home. Save your men. Yeah, he's like, fuck it. I don't get I'll impregnate everybody. <laughs> <laughs> the Lagoos Alliance may have lost the war of might. But we haven't lost the war to save the lives of our brothers. This fight will be ours. Yes, with the fangs and wings of the light gears and the knowledge of the Bjork, we will return home. I forgot you were here. I forgot, I forgot you, you were, were here. here. Yeah. <laughs> Dan can't cannot stop us now, just as they could not stop us during the Mad King's War. We can do this. No, he can't, Ryson. You are like oddly puffing out his chest, Ryson. He's like the last. Like I gotta get the last word in. I gotta get the last word in. <laughs> All He's right. like the annoying little sibling. Yeah, it's like fucking come cat on, cat fight. fight. Fucking it's shit. shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know, maybe. So it happens to be that I have a very rare and precious item in my possession. Which of you thinks you deserve a gift? Lev flashes her tits. <laughs> yeah, liar. He's, He's like, do you want them now? He's like. <laughs> And eh, four out of ten. <laughs> She's like, what? <laughs> you fucker! <laughs> Ooh, me, me. I want it. No, Captain. You should give it to me. After all, I'm your faithful servant. <laughs> it's a fucking laser pointer. He, got, he <laughs> borrowed e it from Sword. E e e e <laughs> <laughs> what? No way. That stuffy know-it-all doesn't need it. Look at me. I'm so tiny and helpless. I need all the help I can get. You wouldn't want me hurt, would you? A stuffy know-it-all? Oh, I say. How dare you, madam. <laughs> Captain Randolph, you know that rewarding her behavior, behavior will only encourage her to act up in front of others. Have I not always followed your orders without question, both quickly and effectively? Alright, alright, sheesh. You know, I personally don't really care which of you gets it. <laughs> that backfired on you, Randolph. Yeah, Randolph was like, gotta make the fight for- oh god. <laughs> you hold it right there, Kizza. I think you just call me a brat. Hell yeah! Pfft. I'm only stating the obvious. If you don't like it, don't act so childish. Huh, you stuck up old alley cat. Stuck up? Your mother would be ashamed at your lack of manners. Fuck my mom! Ah, stop it already. I'm so sorry I asked. Obviously I have to make the decision for you. Alright, Kizza, <laughs> this is yours. Take it. <laughs> oh, thank you, thank you. You've made me the happiest person in the army, Captain. Ha! <laughs> what? Why? Why did you give it to him? He's your commanding officer. That's not fair. He's a stuffy old boar. I'm wearing my prettiest collar. What? <laughs> <laughs> Forget it, liar. The captain knows who slaves day and night to keep the army running smoothly. 
No, no, no. The captain's love is mine. All mine. Give it to me. If you want it, you'll have to take it. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, you're dead. What is it with you two? Ugh. God. You gotta howl. Right. Whoop, freakity do. <laughs> Man, that at was that something point, to fight over. Yeah, at that point, it's probably better to have Kizza ha let it, you know. Yeah. Take it, whatever. All right, though. We'll call it for this episode. <laughs> and we'll catch you guys next time in more... Oh, everyone's <laughs> fucking everything up. And Randolph is just wants to it's lay on the ground and die. It's fucking everything up. It's Benyon fucking, fucking everything yeah, up. Yeah, Benyon's playing everybody right yeah, now. Yeah, they really are. It's nice. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, till next time. Bye. Bye.